Hey guys, for this portion of your training, we will be reviewing how to check the status of a specimen. So from your dashboard main menu on the left hand side, you will select view all orders. This will bring you to your requisition table, which will list all of the specimen that your clinic has sent in to Precision Point Diagnostics. You may then use this status option with the drop down menu to select the status that you are looking to search for. You can select complete, in transit, on hold, processing, received, preliminary results, results available, rejected, save for signature, save for later, specimen collected, unpaid dropship, or paid dropship. From there, it will show you once you hit search. It will show you everything that you have sent in that has been rejected. Or any various uh, status that you have selected. Let me reset that. Again, if you scroll over this blue question mark, you will see an explanation of all the statuses and what they mean. Uh, when the specimen arrives at Precision Point Diagnostics, that specimen is going to be placed into a received status, as you can see in purple where then it is going to be moved into one of the following on hold, rejected or processing. That is down here in the middle. As you can see, there are some statuses that are above that. These status options are available to those that are placing their orders through their portal, meaning it's a digital requisition that you create in house and is submitted through the portal. So for those that are submitted through the portal, there are some provider actions such as save for signature or save for later. Say that you or one of your office uh, workers are creating that requisition and they are missing the signature from the physician, they would use the save for signature option. If they are missing any information from the patient, they can use the save for later option and you can filter the status for those to see which ones there are and apply that missing information and then submit that requisition. Uh, once you have collected the specimen, if you are collecting it in your clinic, you may choose to change that status to specimen collected. And then you may also update that status again to in transit once that sample has been begun the transit process from you to Precision Point Diagnostics. Again, those are only available for requisitions that are generated by the provider in their portal. Now, again, once the specimen is received at Precision Point, whether it is a digital requisition or a paper requisition, it will go into received status, which means that it has arrived from the provider or the client to our lab. From there, it will go either on hold, it will be rejected, or the, the sample will be processing. If it goes on hold, that simply means that our laboratory has detected an issue with either the specimen, the requisition, or a billing portion. So please contact customer service to resolve that issue so that we may move that specimen into the processing status. We will also be reaching out to collect any information, whether it be to the provider or the patient, depending on what that issue is. Next would be rejected. This simply means that the sample does not meet our collection criteria or the quality or quantity was not sufficient to process. So please contact customer service again. We will also be reaching out to you as well. Next would be processing. This means we have received your specimen, everything looks great, and the sample is now undergoing a run process. Once it has been processed, you will then see a preliminary results status. This means that a report has been generated and it is currently under review by a technical supervisor or a data analyst. Once it has been reviewed, it will then go into results available. This means that the sample has been processed and a verified report has been generated. Finally, you will reach the completed status. This means that your sample has been processed, patient results are uploaded into your client portal, and the payment has been processed. Again, you can use the status here, drop down menu to select any status that you are looking to filter for on your requisition table. Or if you're looking for any one patient, you can use the first name, last name, or date of birth, 
order number or a session number to filter through and find that one specific patient. And from there, you will be able to view their status as well. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call at 678-736-6374, extension 1 for customer service, or give us an email at info at precisionpointdiagnostics.com. Thank you so much.